All right, guys, welcome to episode 51 of Dough Talk TV. It's yours truly, Low Key. Got John here with me. Got Toby in the back. Got the Mad Hatter in the back over there. We're back with another episode, man. We appreciate everybody that's liking, sharing, subscribing. You know what I'm saying? Thumbs up, all that good shit. If you're new to the family, welcome to the Dough Talk family, man. It's all love and good vibrations over here. But, um, But yeah, man, we're back with another episode. We're sparking up. You know what I'm saying? What you smoking on over there, Marvin? Smoking on some cake mix. Some cake mix. Yeah, that's what I'm ro- rolling with too, bro. Shit tastes like some cake. That good. That shit's good. Tastes like gas. some fucking wedding cake or some shit. That shit's gas, bro. <laughs> it gets me on the right on the right mindset. Yeah, but bro. yeah, man. Fucking, it's crazy how how you know we've come a long way when it comes to like law enforcement and like just the way that the law handles certain people. The death, you know, the death penalties something that's been around for a long time right yeah but it's changed a lot it's like sh- niggas back in the day used to get fucking stoned to death in the middle of the fucking plaza that's how it should be right now. <laughs> <laughs> you know what i'm saying imagine getting stoned to death that's fucking horrible yeah you know, that's crazy hit. but now nah, some people deserve it bro yeah yeah you know, yeah pedophiles cool. shit like that and like the medieval bad. times and shit no, that's crazy. They used like, to like stretch the guillotine and shit. Yeah, they used to like fucking torture you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Stretch you out until your body torn half type shit. I mean, are you still alive after that? Like, oh no, no, are no. You, I, you're yeah. I, I don't know. You're good. <laughs> dead. You're dead. But your your brain might function for a couple minutes, which is fucked up. Yeah, that's painful. That's a painful yeah. death. Yeah, bro, crazy yeah. shit, bro. People used you. to tie each other. They used to get tied up to horses. You know what I'm saying? Like four horses and you get pulled four ways. Yeah. Type shit. Oh God. Crazy shit's happening, yeah, man. Yeah, that's horrible. I mean, like even hangings. I don't even think we do hangings anymore. But yeah, there's no hangings. Um, but I, I don't know, bro. What's your opinion on the death penalty, though? Do you uh, think it's necessary? <clears throat> you think that they should do away with it? Yeah, I feel like they should. Really? Yeah, like I, like I feel like the firing squad was good. Instant death. You know? So you don't think we should get rid of the the death penalty? Well, the firing squad, you. like like they'll kill him, right? That's that's pretty much the death penalty, right? Yeah, that's that's kind of. No, that is part of the death penalty. But the oh. question is, do you believe in it? Do you think that it's right? If it, do you think it's right for the law to say this guy needs to be fucking killed? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I feel like I feel like that's necessary. It depends on what they do. Yeah, no nah, facts. I agree, bro. I agree. I think it's. <sighs> I think it's definitely necessary, bro. Like some people, some people are really real deal, like fucked up, right? Like monsters on this earth, bro. Like raping, killing, fucking doing crazy shit, terroristic acts, crazy shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That where it's like, bro, you really don't have a place in society. <coughs> like, yeah, when there's good, there's evil. Yeah, that's everywhere, bro. But yeah. the evil on this earth is evil, my nigga. And yeah. It's like, some people don't. I don't know. Some people don't deserve. Don't deserve to live. That's just my opinion. Some, some people just come up; they're just meant to be bad people. You know? Yeah, bro. <coughs> That's crazy. Right. And then some people lose all sense of fucking feelings. You know what I'm saying? Of emotion because of the shit they've been through, which is sad, bro. But if you guys, you know what I'm saying? If you agree with the death penalty, guys, go down in the comments and let us know if you do or don't. But um, let but yeah, know. bro. Tell me about your Bosnian fucking friend, bro, and his clubs. <laughs> I was out there, we were having a couple <laughs> shots, you know what I'm saying, talking shit. He's a good buddy of mine. I was over there having, you know, just a couple smokes, talking shit. And he was telling me, you know, he's from Bosnia. You know what I'm saying? So, Bosnia. Shout out to Bosnia, yeah, man. Yeah, bro. So, he, he see, he's seen it all, man. Like, he even speaks the language, like, fluently and everything. So, he's literally from there. Right. And we're talking about clubs, and I was showing him the music that we do. And, uh, yeah, guys, you know, we, we do music, too, yeah, man. man. I'm going to put the link, link in down. the description, bro. Link in bio is coming soon. Yeah, bro. Our mixtape coming soon. Exactly. And, uh, yeah, we're talking about it. He loves our music. He's like, yeah, man, he's just showing it out. And, he, and he's like, man, this is like club music, man. This would rock in the fucking caves, man. <laughs> in the caves. I'm like, what the, the caves? fuck you That sounds about? like a dope club. No, yo, that sounds cool, man. Is it like an actual cave, you know, with AC and shit? He's like, nah, man, there ain't no AC. <laughs> they got wires drop like you could trip over the wires you gotta be they careful got wires on the floor all the way in you deep wanna in sit there. down pick a rock 
All There's right. fucking bats on the roof fucking shitting on people. <laughs> you know, the bathroom is around the fucking corner in a fucking hole. It's I don't a know. hole in the ground behind the big boulder over there. Yeah. <laughs> they got lights flashing. So they got the lights. They got the drinks. But the ice, it must melt. Cause, they you know probably have no ice with it. They They're probably, probably drinking that shit straight warm. Damn, that's crazy. Get fucked up in a cave. You probably saw fucking Ben fuck. Laden in there. Fucking Yo, cooling. Facts. Chilling, bro. <laughs> Pulling all the fucking... Oh, so, robe so, in that bitch. so what happens if if there's an earthquake or like you know the blast of music I mean, in there? You're fucked. <laughs> if that cave starts collapsing, what else are you gonna do, bro? You better you might as well just start like fucking and die doing that. In a cave, dog. <laughs> Real talk. You told me there's a lot of drugs in there too. Oh, I'm sure, bitch. If you're in a cave, <laughs> niggas is tripping on shit. To even, niggas is tripping just to just to even go there, like for real, for real. No, that's true. But nah, man, that's that's something that's like, hey, bro, we're talking shit, but look, man, honestly, not all countries, you know what I'm saying, have the same fucking amenities that other countries have. Yeah, like, we're all you know, different. Like America, we, you know what I'm saying, we're lucky to be able to fucking go to good clubs and fucking, you know, clubs that are inside with AC, we're enjoying ourselves, whatever, and fans and shit. Yeah. There's third world countries that don't have that, but guess what? They still like the fucking party. Yeah. They still like <laughs> and they're going out to the fucking cave with a tiki torch and saying, fuck it all. Bro, they're partying regardless. You know what I'm That's saying? That's what I'm it, saying. It, it don't matter. Like, I seen, uh, I saw a video of, like, I forgot which country it was, but they had a concert, but it was canceled because of the whole, you know, the virus and stuff like that, whatever. But they had they rented out a whole side of the fucking hotel with balconies, and four or five people were able to stay in each balcony and watch the whole concert. That's dope, man. So the whole side of the fucking building was there just smoking, getting fucked Chilling, up. Chilling, bro. Like, Cooler. I'm like, man, that's lit. That's dope, bro. That's for lit. real, for real. But you know what's not dope, bro? Nah, man. There's a this lot of This new things. fucking trend of yeah. people shaving their fucking eyebrows, my nigga. Yeah. That's not dope, guys. Don't shave your fucking eyebrows, bro. <sighs> you know, look me. like a clown. Imagine me. How would oh I look? Oh, my God. He'd look like an egg. <laughs> he looked like... <laughs> He looked like an egg from the fucking from mustache Sonic. up. From Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. That shit. L- listen, man. There's been a lot of stupid trends. <laughs> I remember growing up, the planking bullshit. Oh, my God. Planking. I'm you remember talking. planking? Yeah. That yeah, was a more was, simpler time. But it was so fucking stupid. Yeah. It made my head hurt even then. Yeah. And that was my generation. People planking on top of like, McDonald's signs and shit. Fucking falling off and breaking their necks. So, yeah. A few people died. Yeah. Because of that stupid <laughs> shit. But the point is, there's been a lot of fucking stupid ass fucking jobs. Uh, nah, facts. But regardless, bro, like, yeah. why the fuck would you shave your eyebrows? Uh, What's, like, what? I feel like they, it's either A, they're going to draw them in, like a tattoo. Oh, Because women do that now. They just shave it off. It's and girls? Like, it's a girl thing? Yeah, it's a girl thing. Oh, yeah, then there's nothing yeah. to talk about. Yeah, yeah. But but even then. Yeah, but <laughs> you know, I don't think they're shaving it back in. I think they're just leaving it like that. No, but I'll like the girls what. that let their, their fucking armpit hair grow, like. What the fuck? Yeah, there's a, there's a I trend I mean, you do what too. you do is your body, but. That's disgusting. I, Holy I fuck. Don't like, yeah, you know I don't what? Like I, that I that think it's shit. disgusting to have fucking hair in your back as a girl. Whoa, bitch! What the, hold on, we're going to the not, deep not, fucking <laughs> waters now. What kind of bitches you be fucking with now? This has got fucking hairy nah, fucking offense. Some fucking Latinas, man. Nah, I told you. Fuck out of here, bro. Uh, I've been with a few Latinas. I love, I love y'all. No, Latinas. no, I love y'all too. You know what I'm saying? And nah, I, didn't, nah, I wasn't shit, with no hairy back. Shave them arms, too. baby. Nah, yeah. Nah, nah. nah. You're a piece of shit. <laughs> Shave the moms when this nigga got a whole fucking bodysuit of fucking hair. <laughs> nah, for real. <laughs> Yo, my hair, Here my hair. His clothes off, and he looks like he's in a fucking onesie. Nah, I'm, <laughs> nah, I'm pretty fucking hairy like my father, man. You know, my, my fucking chest hair connects to my neck, bro, and then my neck all the way to my shoulders and to and my then your butt. shoulders <laughs> to your fucking back, then your back to your it's crack, crack. Then your crack to your sack, <laughs> and then from your sack back up to your fucking. Trail line, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and all the way back up to your chin. <laughs> nah, what the fuck, that? That's a Holy that shit! Holy fuck, nah, bro. bro. But you know what? The but it's okay, man. bro. We're guys, man. We're good. We're it's good. okay, bro. Mosquitoes too. It makes it harder for them <laughs> <laughs> to get in there with that. Like that fucking guy to rub himself down with fucking yeah. mud and shit. I'm just like to fucking, get... <laughs> I'm like fucking Sandy from fucking SpongeBob <laughs> when they're trying to fucking take that fur. Yeah, I remember that shit. 
God damn. <laughs> Oh my god, bro. That was a funny ass episode. You can make yourself a whole fucking coat. <laughs> <laughs> That's illegal. <laughs> oh, fuck. But yeah, bro, I thought that, that the whole eyebrow thing was like a whole fad, like the, all the kids are doing it. If it's a girl thing and they're doing it to like... Just, I don't know. Maybe there's guys you know, doing it too. But, I'm sure there is. But the ones that I saw were women. Okay, well, then, then, you know, that's different. That's different. That's, yeah. if that's what that's what girls want to do now is like have their eyebrows tattooed instead of have them natural. Yeah, my mom she actually guess, did it, but it was so funny. Yeah. I made fun of her because like no, nah, the first couple yeah. of days them <laughs> shit was so is. dark. <laughs> yeah, I've seen a few bitches be like, oh my god, bitch, you fucking yeah. look like. A- <laughs> but they fade away. You know, it's like Beijing when I had the Beijing on my forehead. <laughs> Amazing <laughs> on my forehead. I forgot about that. Yo, man. Yo, who's guys, still doing before, that? <laughs> before we started this luxurious podcast life, my dog had a whole edge up <laughs> done by Beijing. Facts. I did. And it was like so noticeable because in Corona, Bad, there was a light right here, right above me. Bro, so you could tell niggas ball. So you could tell that shit was fucking lined the fuck up. She's like, Dang. when I saw my boss for the first day, he was like, something, something seems off about you today. Your fucking hair looks like <laughs> you fucking grew Can't all the be. night. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that nah, was bro. trash. Nah, but, but like, fucking <laughs> <laughs> DJ Khaled, bro. Yo, nah, DJ Khaled, bro. DJ Khaled. Yo, Khaled, my man. Nah, you seen his what beard, bro. What the fuck? That's nah, bro. Beijing, bro. That's, That's Beijing. Yo, you hop in a pool, my guy. No, nah, no, nah, it's waterproof. That oh, shit yeah? don't come off. Well, I'll t- well, fuck, man. Yeah, bro. It better not. Yeah, that's you'll it. You'll be fucking pissed, dr- fucking swimming in a black fucking. Dr- <laughs> I swear to God, he had one of those little. He had a in the, in the barber shop, bro. I went to. He, I swear to God, he said, "Yo, bro, can I use some Beijing on you?" I was like, "Yeah, sure." Fuck it. Let's see what you can do. Nah, Motherfucker sprayed that shit. He took out a whole fucking, like, spray. Like, you're about to spray a fucking... Oh, fucking... <laughs> spray The can. air gun he had with a little compressor, little can, and it turned on every five minutes. <laughs> and he was, like, fucking spraying that shit on me like I was a fucking Pepsi can or a fucking... I don't know, bro. Well, like, I was a fucking... Spray painting the fuck out your forehead. God damn. Um... But yeah, I came out and I was man. People were looking at me funny, man, because my beard looked Cause like your shit looked crazy. Yeah, it looked like I, was, <laughs> <laughs> I looked like the guy off that fucking. Oh, I forgot the cartoon. If you guys know, but he had like all tattooed. It was weird. He had like a dark fucking beard. I forgot yeah, what it was, but listen, guys, that's not fresh. <laughs> Don't just go bald before you start putting Beijing on your fucking scalp. I saw somebody that I saw a meme. A girl, she was like, oh. uh... If your beard doesn't connect, we can't connect. <laughs> I was like, damn, baby. Yeah, don't do them like that. Yeah, that's fucked up. Hey, bro, I, I agree. If you My can't whole grow, body connects. If you can't grow a full beard, are you a full man? Yeah. Nah, Toby, are you a full man? I <laughs> <laughs> got a yeah, small told. ass goatee over there. Yeah, in fact, you know, he came a long way, though. <laughs> Nah, I love you, Tom. Nah, but you know what, bro? Going back to the old days, but I remember, you know what I'm saying? Fucking getting ready to go out. You're chilling. You're smoking. You're vibing. You're pre-gaming with your crew, and y'all all pull over. Everybody gets out the car, walks in the liquor store, and you all buy a fucking white tea. Oh, shit. You all buy Man, a dope boy wear, white tea, bro. I can only wear them once. Because yeah, that's yeah, all. Cause, that's cause I, because I wash them, and then they shrink, and then it yeah, just doesn't it shrinks, fit right. Yeah, it shrinks, and then the white ain't white no more, yeah, and then it's different. But that first way, <laughs> the, <laughs> first day, the first time you <laughs> no, put that white yeah. tea on, that, no, hey, yeah. y'all Florida motherfuckers know what we're talking about, them dope boy white teas, man. They're yeah. six, seven dollars. <laughs> yeah. Six or seven dollars in the, you know what I'm saying, in the little beep stores, bro. Facts. They're way better than the Hanes or whatever the way fuck you got be- going oh, on. Oh, fuck a Hanes compared yeah. to a beep yeah. white tea. I'm like, sorry, Michael what? Jordan, but Hanes ain't worried that right nah, now. Nah, dog. You tripping. You bugging out yeah. if you ain't fucking going to a beep to fucking get a white, dope old white tea, bro. <laughs> oh, I'm talking shit. For I got sure. Hanes boxes on. Hey, fuck it, bro. Take them bitches off. Go get a dope boy <laughs> white box. I'll be like Toby. This guy <laughs> fucking walks around with no underwear everywhere. <laughs> Free balling, bro. Free balling. Hell no. Nah, but yeah, nah, bro. Them shits, this shit's saved your life. You're on the way to the club. You spill some shit on your fucking shirt. You're like, fuck. Damn. Pull over $6 to change your whole mood. You fucking change that shirt, put that white tee on, nigga. You feeling uh-huh. fresh. Bro, you coming out fucking fresh as I'm a motherfucker. You, you have I the swear. white Air Forces on, yeah. too? 
It's a wrap. Bro, if you wear a black tee, that's classy anyway. Yeah. I fact. swear. The cla- that's a classy black color. Tees, black tees are, are classy, but there's something about a white tee that just lets you know, oh, this nigga don't care if his shirt get dirty. No, nah, for real. It's he like got the money. Air Force. <laughs> the Air Force, yeah, he don't give a fuck. Nah, facts, bro. For real yeah. talk. Nah. But yeah, man. Going on to something that's fucking hilarious, bro. Damn. <laughs> I, think, I think I already know. prison escape. Oh, shit. The prison escape gone wrong, guys. I heard about that. Yeah, you sent me that. Bro, there's a story of this guy who supposedly, allegedly, we don't know if it's a real story. We don't. But supposedly there's this guy that fucking <laughs> dug his way through a cement wall for five years with a spoon and when he <laughs> broke out on the other side that nigga broke out into the guards room in the prison this nigga was <laughs> <laughs> yo bro what the fuck five years bro, bro. wait shit up bro they probably heard that shit from a mile away bro that's exactly what I was they thinking, let him work bro. for it yeah bro that bro George was over there sitting in the corner hearing that fucking nigga working at that wall for the last five years bro he's like I'm gonna see how far he gets I mean man them guards must suck then if he nah them guards knew what was up bro. yeah they knew they yeah, had you to. hear this nigga like, think about it, bro. Once, once you get right next to the wall and you're sitting here with a fucking <laughs> hitting that shit, they're like, they're just looking at that shit like, bro. Yo, come in. <laughs> come in. Yo, Ricky, look at this shit. You hear this shit? What the fuck is yeah, this? This nigga think he's doing something. He's going to break out wait, into our break room. Wait till he comes out. I'm going to punch him right in the fucking mouth. <laughs> They probably beat his ass up. Yeah, probably fuck, nah, brother. Humiliation is good enough. I'm going to just laugh at your stupid ass and go put you in another zone. Nah, for real. Like, for real, that bro. That's fucking crazy. Nah, that, just escaping prison is hard as fuck. Nah, bro. But they, they've done it. They've done it. There's, they a couple, there's a couple boys out there that are running right now in Alaska <laughs> free. Yeah. In the fucking bush. They went to Mexico. <laughs> They're chilling. They're cooling, bro. For real. There's a, there's a few people that, that escaped prison never been found, and I'm sure they're still alive somewhere. That's how it goes. Everybody don't get caught, but most do. <laughs> yeah, most do. And if you don't have a life sentence, it really makes no sense to try it. Yeah, if you have a life because sentence. Because it's like an extra 15-year charge in Florida anyway. I don't know about anywhere else. But in Florida, you try to escape prison, bro, you, you could be facing up to 15 extra years added on to your sentence. So if you got like six years and you try to break out of prison, now you got 21, you dumb fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like, congratulations. Nah, that's not stupid funny. Stupid fuck. Nah, but nah, you know nah, what? But nah, this is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, damn, damn bitch. Damn, 21 years. The fuck, bro. nigga? You were coming home in four years. You were two down. <laughs> now you got to do 20 more. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. trash, bro. I can't believe that shit. Um... Nah, that's horrible. That sounds horrible. Yeah, nah, I don't wish that shit on nobody, bro. Nah. For real, for real. But yeah, bro, moving on to something completely fucking crazy. I just wanted to talk about it because I couldn't fucking believe it. Whatever. Until I looked up the documentary done by Vice. Mm. And Yeah, I watched them on YouTube. Bruh. In North, I think it's Northeastern Columbia. Don't quote me on that. But something like that in North Columbia or Northeastern Columbia. Most men end up having their first sexual experience with a fucking donkey. <laughs> a donkey. A donkey. <laughs> you have to say what a fucking accent. A donkey. A donkey. <laughs> Bitch, come on. <laughs> 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 no, no, no. <laughs> I'm going to tell you what. What the fuck is going on nah, with Colombia? I knew it. What the I knew fuck? It. I knew it. Nah, bro. Pablo was on some shit. That nigga put these niggas on dope and they never been right ever since. Nah, that's fucking horrible. That's wild, bro. Like, bro, Colombia imagine. has some of the most beautiful women on earth. Yeah, I understand. Why the fuck would you go hit a donkey? They were growing up in a farm, maybe. I don't know. I don't want to hear that <laughs> shit, bro. <laughs> trying to defend them and shit. Yeah, fuck out of here. I mean, I could kind of see, you know, you lonely one time and the fucking Betsy's over here. Nah. Like, soft as fuck. Nah, like, nah, bitch, nah. get the fuck out of here. Nah, you got nah. a hot-ass next-door neighbor. No, nah, I think that's like, just, like, some weird-ass shit. That's just, maybe they fuck their cousins, too. I don't know. They, If you fuck a donkey, bitch, you, fu- <laughs> you fuck anything else. <laughs> that's <laughs> like, true. For real, bro. That's fucking crazy. Nah, that's fu- that. That's fucking wild, and not to, not to shit on Colombians or, no, or Colombia, no, no. nothing Columbia's like that. Good. Love love goes out to all my Colombians, and yeah. love goes out to Colombia, bro. It was just something that I read, and something that just blew my fucking mind. I just couldn't believe it. 
Yeah, that's kind of like... And then it lets you realize, like, bro, this world is really crazy. Like, there's crazy shit going on out here every day. And just because you live in your little secluded part of the world doesn't mean that that shit don't go on everywhere else. What if it's like, like, what if, like, every country has its own animal you gotta fuck to make you a man? Like, you know, like, fucking what do you Africa. Think, what do you think Africa, our country would be? Africa, you, you think gotta think fuck a fucking lion? <laughs> <laughs> you become leader of your yeah, tribe. Yeah. Them Congo uh, niggas might. Yeah. You know what nah, I'm bro. Saying? What do you think? What do you think <laughs> the animal would be for here? Oh man, for the animal, probably an eagle. Holy a shit! Eagle, you got a fucking eagle. Get on top My of the tree, nigga. climb that a bitch. Fucking. Do you hear this stupid shit? A yeah. fucking eagle. America. Nah, you know I man? think it'd be like a cow or some stupid <laughs> shit. <laughs> No. For real. Go fucking cow tipping and shit. <laughs> it will hey, show that cow hey, tip. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yo, guys, no, that's fucking no, that's ridiculous gross, that's gross. nasty. We don't condone bestiality. That's nah. fucking crazy. That's what it's called? Bestiality, yeah. When you fuck <laughs> animals. This nigga's out here fucking pigs and all time. Like crazy shit, bro. Like, what the fuck, man? Yeah, that's a sport or some shit. Oh, yeah. no, nigga. It's some wild shit, bro. But hey, bro, I guess do what you do. Just don't bring it around me, bro. Nah, nah, we're not. Real talk. That, yeah. yeah, don't. Don't bring it around me. But yeah, guys, <laughs> we appreciate you guys for coming back and tuning back in. Don't forget, at a thousand subscribers, we will be giving something thumbs away. Up. So let us know what you guys want to see us give away. Don't forget to thumbs up. If you're new to the family, welcome. If you're coming back, we appreciate it once again. And we out. Peace. Peace.